Ancient people on our planet sought to use the most gigantic building blocks imaginable. On display around our world are feats of mind-numbing creation, designed by a people who used the heaviest and densest materials available. The ancient earthlings moved stone on an industrious scale in the remote past, leaving the enigma in modern times as to how this was done. Levitated mass is a 340 tonne boulder that was moved with years of planning and with specialist equipment designed by Emirates International. And this took 11 days to transport the stone just 60 miles. How did the ancient people do it thousands of years ago if we need modern machinery to move a block the fraction of the weight of, say, the western stone from the western wall? A strange fact about the western stone of the western wall is that its depths are not known because it is hidden within the wall. An estimate depth from a ground penetrating radar device returned a depth estimate of 16.5 metres and if this is true, it means that the western stone weighs an eye watering 600 tonnes and is recorded as one of the heaviest stones known to have been moved by humans without powered machinery. The stone is 13.5 metres long and 3.5 metres tall with the estimated depth of 16.5 metres. The stone is located in a section of the western wall north of Wilson's Arch, below ground level, and can be accessed through the western wall tunnels. It is estimated to weigh close to 600 tonnes, but no conclusive weight can be designated without knowing the true depth of the stone. Of course, there are stones around the world, including the ones discovered at Baalbek, Dwarf, the western stone in size, scale and imagination. Close to the site of the Temple of Jupiter in Baalbek is the quarry site where extraordinary building blocks are discovered. The stone of the south weighs 1,242 tonnes. The stone of the pregnant woman weighs over 1,000 tonnes. And the forgotten monolith, still in situ right next to the stone of the pregnant woman and sometimes overlooked, for this reason it is known as a forgotten stone and weighs a jaw-dropping 1,650 tonnes, making it one of the largest stones ever quarried. Three smaller stones apparently raised into place by an ancient people are known as the Trilophon, also called the Three Stones, and these stones form a group of three horizontally lying giant stones which form part of the podium of the Temple of Jupiter Baal at Baalbek. The location of the megalithic structure is atop of a hill in the region known as Tel Baalbek. Each one of these stones is 19 metres long, 4.2 metres high and 3.6 metres thick and these stones weigh between 750 and 800 tonnes each. The supporting stone layers beneath the trilophon features a number of stones which weighs an estimated 350 tonnes each and are 11 metres wide. Experts around the globe are perplexed as to how ancient peoples accomplished these dramatic feats of engineering that seem to dwarf what is possible in modern times. Why is that? Is there a forgotten technology? Thousands of years ago our world was a different place, a planet ejected out of a golden age of plenty the earthlings reacted by building structures of overwhelming dimensions. Structures that would withstand an impact over time. Maybe if we can understand why these places exist, can we begin to understand how the ancients created them? But what do you guys think? Comments below. And as always, thank you for watching. Nearly a hairline crack separating one 800 ton block from the next. And then at the Temple of Bacchus, which is next door, once again the huge sense of scale of the stones. Once again these large stones are somewhere in the nature of 500 to 800 tons apiece. There you see the incredible precision of the fit. Barely a hairline crack, either vertical or horizontal.